na taarifa inayofungamana na afya ambapo Wizara ya Afya imetangaza kuimarisha utaratibu wa kuingia nchini kutokana na mlipuko wa aina mpya ya virusi vya corona. Wasafiri wanaoingia nchini kutoka mataifa ya Afrika Kusini, Botswana na Hong Kong watahitajika kukaguliwa zaidi na kuwekwa karantini. Wanasayansi wametaja aina hiyo mpya kama ya kutisha. Ben Kirui ana maelezo zaidi. Kutangazwa kwa aina mpya ya virusi vya corona vilivyogunduliwa hivi karibuni katika mataifa ya Afrika Kusini, Botswana na Hong Kong kumezua hofu kote duniani. Hapa nchini Wizara ya Afya tayari imechukua hatua na kutangaza tahadhari kabla ya hatari. We have continued to enhance our level of surveillance at our ports of entry especially for visitors coming from the three countries so they are going to go through a more rigorous screening process including rapid antigen testing at the point of arrival to ensure that if we have a positive case then they can quickly be quarantined we do genomic sequencing to be able to determine whether they have the variant ingawa bado ni mapema na visa vilivyodhibitishwa bado vipo zaidi katika jimbo moja nchini Afrika Kusini kuna viashiria kwamba huenda virusi vya ugonjwa huo vikaenea zaidi. Tayari kumekuwa na hofu na maswali chungu nzima kuhusiana na kirusi hiki kipya, uwezo wake wa kuenea na hata kupenyeza kinga ya chanjo dhidi ya corona. It is likely that this variant may be able to do what we call vaccine escape meaning that if you are, even if you are fully vaccinated because of the change on its nature then you could still be able to get the infection kutokana na hofu wa kuenea kwa virusi hivyo vipya mataifa kama vile Uingereza na Israeli yamechukua hatua ya kupiga marufuku safari za raia kutoka mataifa matatu ambayo yamepatwa na virusi hivyo i wish to stress that we're working quickly and we're working with a high degree of uncertainty we are continuing to make assessments including about those countries with strong travel links to South Africa and we are working with our international partners including South Africa and the European Union to ensure an aligned response hata hivyo shirika la afya duniani WHO limetoa tahadhari kwa mataifa dhidi ya kuchukua hatua za haraka kama Uingereza kwa sasa uchunguzi wa kisayansi katika maabara unaendelea ili kutoa picha ya wazi kuhusu athari za virusi hivyo Ben Kirui Runinga ya Citizen Nairobi